Yeah, man. Good morning, y'all. Or should I say, good afternoon. Yeah, because these things dropped at 12. I think I got my notification like at 12 o'clock, 12 on 1 uh, p.m. So, shock drop. Well, not shock drop. Exclusive access action. Uh, first of all, what's going on, everybody? I hope everybody, each and every last one of y'all, is having a blessed day today, man. I'm a little tired, man. I just had a um, procedure where they had to... Um, I've been having, like, stomach issues a lot, so I had to have a procedure where they put me to sleep, like, on anesthesia, and put a camera down my throat and look all inside my stomach to make sure everything good. <laughs> good. So, that's what I just left them doing. I still got the... Um, the little hospital uh, tag on my wrist and stuff like that. So that's what I just got finished doing. So if I'm calmed down a little bit, that's because I'm still kind of medicated or whatever. But anyway, so I came home. Shout out to my wife. She gave me a ride out there. Gave me a ride home. I can't drive for like the rest of the day. They say I need to like stay by, stay out from behind the steering wheel. So I figured I'd just do this video after this exclusive access. I did try on the um, shock drop. And I took an L. I was on the shot drop at like right at tw uh, 2.23 when they dropped. I mean, I jumped on there a quick shot. I was like, man. Because I told y'all, a lot of people jumped in the comments, even when I put the post on Instagram. Like, Reach, I thought you didn't want to buy. Y'all, boy, be changing. Y'all, man, y'all follow height, shawty. If you would have saw my review on the, my early review on the shoe, as soon as I pulled that shoe out, I was like, bro, these hard, man. Like, the materials, that leather upper. Them gold hits, that milky bottom, just those three um, small detail changes from the Concords was enough for me to just be like, you know what, I want to have this one in hand too. Now, with that being said, I could get the shoe and then look at my pair of Concords and be like, dang, did I make a mistake? Because I got these. And I put the shoes side by side from, if you don't know nothing about sneakers and you look down at my feet and I got on these and the other person got on DMPs, unless you're looking really close, you're going to be like, man, that's the same shoe. You feel me? So when I get it in, I'm going to make a, I mean, I made a decision to buy them already so I might keep them, but at the same time, who knows, later on down the line, I'm going to be like, I don't need Concords and Gratitudes. I know a lot of people that were hollering that uh, Skip goes hard, he was like, you know what I'm saying? You can put the Concords on ice and rock the Gratitudes, but like they both still the same shoe, so it's like, and I rarely wear the Concords, as you can see, these things, 2018, still looking kind of crispy, you feel me? So, uh, so I don't know if I made the right decision, but like I said, I just came back from my procedure at the hospital. I get home, I'm just chilling, scrolling through uh, IG, stuff like that, just just laying on the couch with my wife, and then the, um, the uh, notification came. Usually I have to get some kind of Twitter notification or somebody that text me and be like, hey, they just did exclusive access. Check, check your exclusive access, shout out, you feel me? But now nah, these came up through my notification straight like my phone buzz and notification. It said sneaker, so of course I'm going to swipe down and click on it. Then gratitudes, uh, exclusive access, man. So anyway, shout sneakers out for that. But the question is, like I said, the got them. It's so weird because usually here are the got them right here. I always keep the got them up. You know what I'm saying? You know, you got to see that. That's what you got to see. You got to see that got them come up. That's that's what make you feel good. And I almost didn't get it because when I... Let's put a got them right here. We got to keep the got them up for the rest of the video. Got them for the rest of the video. <laughs> but it didn't come up right away. And usually on exclusive access, bro, as soon as you put your pay payment information, it come up. One thing I will say about the shock drop is when the sh uh, shock drop came out, I had just had to replace my card because my my little uh, chip wasn't working no more on my card. So I had to replace it. And it, everything else is the same except for the little CVV number on the back. That's the only thing that changed when you replace a lost or a stolen card. So I had to, before, I mean, around the time when the shock drop happened, I had not changed my card information. But so I was wondering, because I was on there right on time and I didn't hit, like everybody I know hit. So I was like, I'm going to change, I'm going to make sure I put this new card in. So after that, the new card arrived to my house and I deactivated the other card and I activated this card. And then I put this information in and um, still the got them didn't come up right away. I actually got a order confirmation in my email. No, 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 no. I got a, I got a, I got a um, notification from Sneakers app. Um, a notification popped up on the top of my screen on my phone before the got them popped up. The notification said uh, order confirmed in, in the damn notifications. And I'm like, damn, what my got them? Got them was, I mean, the, 
sneakers out was still saying processing. I was like, where my guy to met? Shout, I got to have it. That's a part of the $230 I spent. You know what I'm saying? 5% go to the got them sign. You got you to gotta see it pop up. But anyway, like I said, am I going to keep them? I don't know. I already did a review on them. Uh, it was a size like 9 or something I reviewed. And this is size 12, my size. So I want to see what they look like in hand. I mean, I know what they look like in hand, but I just want to see what they look like in my size. There's a big difference between a size 9 and a size uh, 12, man. You know what I'm saying? So, with all that being said, real quick, did y'all hit? Did y'all hit on the Nike uh, sneakers exclusive access? Also, the Air Jordan 13 weeks dropped today. I was going to go to the mall and do like a vlog. I, mean, I know they sitting. I know they sitting. It's, it goes without saying that the Air Jordan 13 wheat was going to sit. Glad I was able to put an early review up. Shout out to everybody who checked out the early review that I dropped. What was that? Yesterday? Sunday. I dropped it Sunday. Shout out to everybody who looked at that video, man. I appreciate y'all for checking it out, man. Love wheat 13s. Not on my list. Too much white. Kind of hard to wear that wheat with everything. You know, just not for me when I'm being selective. It's just not a shoe that I'm trying to go after. In my also humble opinion, you feel me? But comment below if you went after the wheat. 13s if that was a shoe that was on your list that you were waiting on and you went and got them thing you scooped them up you went and grabbed them thing like give me them been waiting 20 years for them guy let me get them guy let me get them back i was in high school i was in elementary school or whatever you was when you wanted to cop week 13 you was able to get them thing for retail because they are sitting in every size on nike sneakers so that leads me to believe that they sitting on every size in the mall as well so uh comment below if you went after the week 13s also Comment below if you did go after. I keep holding the Concords up because I don't have the gratitudes in hand no more. I had to ship that pair. I reviewed back to uh, Lavish Life Sneakers. But comment below if you went after the uh, 11s, man. I mean, if you actually hit uh, exclusive access on the 11s. If you did hit exclusive access on the 11s, did you take an L on the shock drop? You didn't try for the shock drop and you still got exclusive access? One thing I will say before I leave y'all today, I got a confession to make. And it ain't a crazy confession. It's kind of like you probably figured. You, the last outlet vlog that you see me on, I didn't put this part in the vlog because I didn't feel like getting the scrutiny and judgment you know what I'm saying from Rich Nation I ain't feel like hearing it uh, <laughs> the last outlet vlog I did with my boy E yeah I remember my boy E looked like Kadeem Hardison if you haven't checked that video out they had Cherry 12s at outlet and it was a hilarious video my boy E we were tripping going back and forth it was out of chain but um, that day my one of my main purposes for going to the outlets to, was to return the Air Jordan Royal Reimagine. And I didn't get it. It didn't have nothing to do with hype. It didn't have nothing to do with the fact that it wasn't selling out. Because if I really wanted the shoe, I still would have returned them because they were sitting. And then I would have went back on a swoosh account and got them for like almost half off. But I didn't even do that because once I started looking at the shoe and looking at the fact that I got Royal uh, OG Lows, looking at the fact that I got Royal OG Highs, which is the same reasons I didn't want to buy the shoe in the first place, I just started saying I really don't need these, man. And now you know what I'm saying? I... That two hundred dollars I could spend on another shoe. I'm on my knees just dropping and stuff like that. I was like, but I don't need these Royals. I got two other pairs of Royals that look just like it. Let me take them back. But like I said, I ain't want to deal with that scrutiny because originally I wasn't supposed to buy the shoe. Then when I came back near the impulse by and bought the shoe, now I'm returning them again. It's a lot of back and forth. I know what I'm saying, and I know I ain't perfect, man. Sometimes you like something, sometimes you can't. That was an impulse buy buy because I got exclusive access just like I did on these. I got exclusive access. On the Royals and that exclusive access went all day. I should have known when that exclusive access is going all day. I probably would they would have sat and I probably would have been able to get them on swoosh for like half off later on. But it all came down to the fact that I didn't need to reimagine Royals, man. So um anybody who want them, they are sitting at every mile going get them. I'm really starting to wonder if a couple of these pairs are gonna be lingering. I can't wait to the actual release day, what is December 9th, I think. So I can go to the malls to see if these will be sitting around anywhere. I kind of doubt it because they're 11. A lot of people are hyping them up. So out of all shoes to sit, but I doubt it that Royals would sit. I also doubt it that, um, well, actually, playoffs, I thought they would sit. And I thought Royals wouldn't sit. So my, my prediction skills have been really, really off with sneakers this year. Uh, I thought that. I thought that uh, cherries would sell out, and they they kind of did, but they were still sprinkled at a few stores here and there. So I don't know. My prediction skills been off because the sneaker game has been hella unpredictable, man. So anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching. Got them, as you can see. Y'all hit the thumbs up, like the video, subscribe to my channel. Tell me if y'all hit on either shoe that dropped today. If y'all had exclusive access on the Gratitude 11s 
or if you had um, went ahead and copped your Wheat 13s that you've been wanting for the last 20 years, let me know below in the comment section. Hit the thumbs up, like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them and keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Call up the plug, hit me a lick. Early kids from Retro Rick. New air bubble like helium lift. So as the bless, thank God for the gift. Yeah, yeah, it's a hit. Premium fit. No barbecue, but this is it. Hold up, rock, rock, just my hit. With richest kicks, I mean my rich. Yeah, ballin' all the way to the moon on them. Space Jam going on the tune on them. Sweeping y'all haters, get the broom on them. New heat coming real soon on them. Yeah, my rich fans, shout that's what I cop to give for. Thank you for watching these vids, that's what I'm here for. Gone all the way up to the moon on them. What's happening to everybody? Yeah. Life's so lighty daddy. Bless. Hit that Nike store just like your girl hit Hobby Lobby. Then yeah. we fly to Abu Dhabi, then we gone. Straight up to the moon on them. Hey.